So oh yeah, I forgot you still have all those fucking bones. Okay. You said to examine it, but you can't actually do that. What? Well, good job, York. What if it's full of... I don't know. Words and stuff. Yeah. Okay, that's the wrong way. That's back to shooting range. Nah, but like secret words. Quick, dunk it in lemon juice so you can see the invisible ink. <laughs> I still like how they didn't even bother modeling anything outside. No, but at least it's not a green screen right now. I mean... Yeah. <laughs> but then we could chroma key in whatever we want. We could chroma key in L.A. Noir and nobody would tell the difference. I hate that fucking game. I know. Yeah. This game's way better. Somehow. Yeah, it's fucking somehow. Okay. Actually, no. The writing in L.A. Noir was really good. Nah, it was a pretty good game, even if it was kind of a shitty game. I think you know what you know what you know what L.A. Noir is like the nega Deadly Premonition, because like it's kind of shitty, and the writing's really good, but I can't forgive it because it's a triple A title. It should be better. Mm -hmm. This game was made by like a bunch of nobodies for like ten dollars. Well. You know, sweary, but still for ten dollars. Uh, so it's good despite being shit. Basically, Rockstar should fucking know better. Probably. Let's Who are you looking where? for? Olivia. The diner's probably closed because Nick isn't there. Probably. So where do they live? Yeah, oh, that's what we're finding out. Okay. Out. <laughs> Why do I ask these? Again, why do I ask these questions? Okay, so Richard. Romy Sigourney, we're not, we're not doing our stuff. <laughs> but the pot lady! Right, I, that, that's the one part of this game that I adamantly refuse. I don't remember what... what why did it suck so bad? Uh, it's driving. It's driving. You have to get to a point under a time limit, and she's yelling at you about her pocket getting cold the entire time. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I remember this now. Let's see, where does she live? Uh. Or she's not at her house. Where is she in general? So that's the gas station. Oh, that's Grinny again. Yeah, I don't know. No, no, no. Jesus, game. Yeah, can, Maybe, you, can yeah. you get in the back? What I'm wondering. Hmm. They don't, live like, they don't live like right across the street, do they? I don't think so. Bang, that's the sheriff's department. Oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> you can just fucking walk there. I mean, I'm not gonna, but... No. Good. Good. Every time. Every time. Especially that one time. <sighs> oh, York. All right, here's what I'm predicting. That. Never mind. Nope. Nope. It was stupid. I changed my mind. Okay. Okay, now move me back over to the side of the street. Do you want to go somewhere before we visit Harry? That's fine by me. Okay, it was this one, wasn't it? Uh, no, not that one. No, the one next door. Yeah. Huh. 
<sighs> There's a green God screen. God damn it. And oh, that's the wrong one. <laughs> okay, I don't think she realized we were there. Yeah. <laughs> that's awkward. Okay, so Zach is you, Levi, the player. Mm. That's my prediction. And there's probably some sort of meaning to the name Zach, kind of like in Zardoz. You know what I'm saying, right? Uh, I don't know that one specifically. Well, you know Zardoz. Yeah. Do you know where the name Zardoz comes from in the movie? No. Uh, books are banned, but the women, the ruling class, have books. Mm-hmm. Um, and but they're only fractions of books. Okay. And the book that they have that is all torn up that inspired their god is the Wizard of Oz. Okay. But it's torn apart, and so all they can read is Zardoz. So I think that there's some sort of thing like that with Zach. Zach stands for. Well, it had to start with a fucking Z, didn't it? Yeah. I can't do anything with that. Hey, Olivia. Got something for you. Mm -hmm. Have you been through the panda bear? <laughs> you want to check out this bone? <laughs> <laughs> I have something for you from Nick. Can you hand her the bone? Nick asked She's like, oh my god! And he's like, wrong one, wrong one. It's a letter. These are a different bone. him to you. Nick wrote this? For me? Olivia. I'm sorry for all the trouble I am causing you. I'm writing this letter because I need to tell you some things. First, I'm sorry about meeting with Diane without telling you. My actions were irresponsible and may have caused you to misunderstand. I'm sorry you felt but that I way. I swear to God <sighs> I'm not cheating on you. And I didn't kill Diane. That's what I wanted to tell you. As I sit here in this cell, all I can think about is you. <laughs> Don't worry about keeping the diner open. Okay. Try to eat well too. I had thought that this happiness we had would just go <laughs> on forever. I've always been grateful to you, but I've never told you, have I? I used to think that putting it into words made it sound cheap, but at times like these, words are all we need. Thank Mood. you for everything. Once I get home, I'll make it up to you. Take care of yourself. I love you. Nick. Not bad, Nick. Not bad. New York's just staring away. Um, Agent. Could you wait a moment, please? I I've want already to been waiting a, a moment. Reply. Sure. Go ahead. Thank you. Zach, I hope Nick will feel better by this. I didn't know you could control the camera, like, during this. Yeah, I always, I kept forgetting uh, during those. Like, it's not immediately obvious. Go to the rest of the house. So at this point, are you doing specific side quests because you know that what they do, or are you just doing side quests? I'm doing side quests because chances are I'm not going to have much of an opportunity to do side quests later. Okay. Yeah, we're really starting to get into the thick of it. Sheriff's Department, drop this off.
All right, Nick, I saved your marriage for you. You're lucky. Nick, I did some editing on the letter you gave me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, York, no! <laughs> It's a letter from Olivia. From Olivia? What the? I wrote so much. More than I'd, I'd ever actually say. A lot more than this. And she writes me only three lines back. Not enough for you? Oh, no. No, it's, it's more than enough. She wrote as much as she could. That's the best she could do right now. Yeah. Three powerful lines. I believe in you. I'll wait for you. I'm sorry. I, I don't agree with the last one, though. I'm the one who has to apologize. Do you feel a little better now, then? Just wait until the case is finished. I promise this will all come to an end. Yeah. I know, I, I believe you. She's believing in me too, and waiting for me. Well, I have to be going. Now hold, hold on a minute. Aha! What's this? The key to the back door of the diner. There's a big bag in the kitchen. I don't know if you could use it, but consider it yours. You'll have to help yourself to it, of course. I, I can't exactly go with you. Okay. I'll take this and I'll go check it out. Can you imagine if the Royal like War from, from this was a weapon and he just gave it to you here? I mean, even with the key, I'm like, why does he still have that? Big bag. I swear to God, if you check out that big bag and it's full of raincoats, I'm going to be pissed off, dude. Turns out that you do this one little side quest and it just ends the game. Mm -hmm. Like, oh. Oh, Nick did it, okay. Hmm. Still having frame rate issues, eh? It's, it's, it's the old classic, man. The old tried and true. Drop frames. Why not? Who cares? <laughs> yeah, it's not like they haven't remade this game twice yet and had any chance to fix it. <laughs> No, no, that's part of the appeal. All right, back to the back. Oh, it's less used to key more. He pushed a little button on it. Like, it's got a key fob. Did you see that infinite void that we were just in? Yeah! Yeah, I didn't want to talk about it. It was pretty well, spooky. I did. <laughs> it was just like... Oh, okay. Alright, time to raid the kitchen. Since we can finally get back here. Hell yeah. Item bag. Nick was like, if you could use it. But, Zach, this is great. We'll be able to carry more items now, Zach. Well, there we go. So is it a fanny pack? I guess so. Oh no, it's like that one messenger bag I have. It is literally the one messenger bag that you have. <laughs> it's the same thing. I checked the inside of it and it has a reverse piece mark in it. <laughs> oh god, Levi! I can carry more items, but not this one. <laughs> Levi's the raincoat killer. Zach's the raincoat killer! No, no, Levi's Zach. Right? I think that's what I established before. I don't know. Take that mustard and bring it to George. We need a bottle of hot sauce as well. So we can finally put this thing to rest. I still don't know what the fuck that's supposed to be. It's like tackle. I mean... I guess I don't understand fishing. It's just a rubber worm that's supposed to be reusable. 
Oh, uh, well, it doesn't look like a fucking worm. Okay. Now we gotta get to Harry's mansion. Let's see, what's that's just wait. Actually, let's stop at the junkyard as well. So I can swap this out for a faster car. Hell yeah! I almost forgot that we could do that. What did you have to do to get that? To get what? Like, to to upgrade your car. He made The general made you do a bunch of stuff. Yeah, it made me look for parts in the place. Okay, that's what I thought. What did the bones get you? Uh, I have to find Brian the Insomniac. Because he's a gravekeeper. Oh. Oh, oh yeah! Wow. Okay, where the fuck is he? Uh, the graveyard. Why do I... Again? Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember the graveyard. God, that feels like so long ago. Probably because it was so long ago. soldier. I want you to take a look around J-10. I'll need high gear parts. They should be around there somewhere. If you can find them and bring them back to me, I'll be able to increase the top speed of your vehicle. Now that sounds like a plan. It's a fail-proof plan, soldier. You must learn to trust your superiors. Around J-10, then. Your orders are clear. Now roll out! <laughs> So do you have any parts that can improve, like, the control of it or something? Do you have any parts that make it not flip over? Do you have any parts that can improve the frame rate of the game? Okay, now, don't get ridiculous here, okay? Alright, so... Uh, fucking... J10... Does he set so this right place there. up to be a fucking car maze on purpose? No, I think it just happened to be like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh! The highest gear. <laughs> the ultra gear. The omega gear. <laughs> I, I bet that the, uh, like, the shine effect that they put on those gears is what fucked up the frame rate. Game's like, woo! After Effects, calm down. Just gotta dig past That's the bones. This will save your life someday, son. What's the story this time? Speed determines everything on the battlefield. Life or death. You're not going to tell me another story about stomach pains, are you? Son, I told you already. Don't muck your superiors. It's a very serious story this time. It starts with a question. Why did we lose the battle? We had firepower and the air support in the beginning. But looking at the results of a war of attrition, we learned a lesson. We lacked speed when speed was needed. It was our superior's fault. We should have carried out a swifter attack. That would have saved more of our soldiers. Although crybaby Timothy was doomed either way. You really hated that sergeant, didn't you? Don't talk to me with that tone, boy. Words cannot describe how much I hated him. I was at war with a crybaby. No one has enough lives to survive that. He poisoned us with our own food. Washed all our weapons with soap and water. Launched a signal flare thinking it was a firework. Set off countless traps laid by the enemy. More than half of the unit had to return home sick because of him. I don't know how much of this to believe. <laughs> Believe as much as you like. <laughs> I'll keep my side of the promise and get to work on your vehicle. What a dickhead. Kinda. Trust your superiors. Well, if he hates that my so superiors much, are assholes. I'm talking about him. And would a general really even have direct contact with a sergeant? Questions keep mounting. 
I've increased your exhaust and optimized your higher gears. That means you can drive at a faster top speed. Whatever you say, dude. There's still plenty of stuff I can do to make your car go faster. Just come see me again and I'll customize your car a little more. Alright, and now to buy a new car. <laughs> Diane's car. car, what's it doing here? Thomas's car! Oh god. Jason's car. Oh, wait. Jason's car, Keith's car, Lily's car, Nick's. See, it's from my speed. speed. Difficult handling. <sighs> You're full of bad ideas, dude. He gets mad at you for leaving. Yep. Even though you just bought a fucking car from him. He just wants to be left alone. Big red nursery. Why did you buy this car? <laughs> because I'm just so filled with good ideas today. Okay, so we need to go... Okay. Well, as long as you know what you're doing. Nope. <laughs> I wish it came with a willy. Uh, Excuse me. I don't know if that's the way you want to phrase that. Sure it is. Hey, if any of you have a problem with my driving, just contact Forrest Kaysen. <laughs> this is Forrest Kaysen's car! Zach, we've ended up with a third victim. Oh, wrong way. That die if I made it the gallery being a wasted attempt to save her life. It's a real mess, Zack. <sighs> dive. When's the last time I made a dive like that? Oh, I remember. Do you? Oh, I have that. my right, late right. teens. We used to go to those concerts. You and I like punk rock, but we like different types of punk. You liked hard and heavy punk. And Crash and Sham 69. I like the more twisted ones, like the damned Buzzcocks, Sneaky Pop, and Joy Division. We used to talk for hours about the bands we really liked, but for some reason, neither of us listened to the Sex Pistols. Like, they suck. Wonder why that was. Seems strange thinking about it now. I'm surprised the Smiths weren't in there somewhere. Yeah, I'm surprised he wasn't talking about Blink 182. that wilderness doing uh, it does what it wants just like the water in the background and everything else in this game yeah frame rate general that's what the license plate says red tree actually no I think it says red to red I think it says red to read so yeah red to read that's like that sounds like the English way to say it. Or like the phonetic Japanese pronunciation. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Which would make sense. Oh yeah, duh. Never mind. Alright. Sucks that we have a doghouse and no friggin' dog. Right here. Seems like a waste. We should take force, dog. Yeah. Not using it. Honestly, we'll use this in more. <laughs> Mr. Francis York Oh, this guy. Finally, you have arrived. You are welcome to come inside. By the way, did you walk? <laughs> You'll forgive me, I'm not much one for small talk. Let's have our game before these shenanigans. Oh, shenanigans, huh? Sounds exciting. <laughs>